Let's write the decimal 0.275 as a fraction. First off, let's call it 0.275 over 1. It's still equal to 0.275, we're just dividing by 1. But now we have the start of a fraction. I can see I have 1, 2, 3 decimal places. If I have 3 decimal places, I'm going to multiply the decimal here by 1,000. So when I do that, 1,000 times 0 0.275, that'll give me a whole number. 1,000 times 0 0.275 is 275. So now we have a whole number. But we can't just multiply the numerator. We also need to multiply the denominator by 1,000. That's because 1,000 divided by 1,000 is 1. So we're just multiplying by 1. We don't change the value just the way it's represented. So 1,000 times 1, that is 1,000. And now we have a fraction. The decimal 0 0.275 equals the fraction 275 over 1,000. But we can reduce this or simplify it further. So let's give ourselves some room. I know that I can divide 5 into 275 and 1,000. But I could also divide 25 into both of these numbers. 275 divided by 25, that equals 11. 1,000 divided by 25, that equals 40. And we can't reduce this number any further. So the decimal, 0 0.275, it's equal to 11 divided by 40, or you could say it's equal to 275 divided by 1,000. This is Dr. B converting the decimal, 0 0.275, to a fraction. Thanks for watching.